<laughs> the 35th annual Celebrity Chef Ball is happening next Friday the 14th, where over 40 of Chicago's top chefs will participate to raise money for Meals on Wheels. Here in our Studio 41 kitchen with the details <laughs> and a preview is executive chef and owner of SKY and Apollonia, <laughs> Stephen Galanders. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. Yay. This is wonderful. This is such a cool event because people really get to an intimate experience with a lot of cool Chicago chefs. Yes, like very yourself. Much so. Thank you very much. <laughs> Tell um, us how it all works. Yeah, so uh, this year is a little bit unique in that um, we're actually having uh, pods of, okay. uh, of chef teams. Mm. And there's three chefs per pod. Uh, and we basically make a six course tasting menu. So each okay. chef is responsible for two dishes. And uh, we just kind of kind of help each other and create more of an intimate experience as opposed to like the grand galas where it's kind of like, you know, piecemealing it together mm -hmm. and, and having little bites. This one's a proper sit down with six Ooh, courses. And yeah. we're really, really excited. Super uh. collaborative and very much, uh, very integrated. Yeah, yeah speaking of that collaborative, Collaboration. I mean, that you're, you've got three restaurants, which yes. we're going to talk about in a little bit, but how fun is it for you to yeah. get to actually get out of the kitchen and see your colleagues from around the city and cook together? No, I love it. You know, it's funny because... We're always in the, in the restaurants. Uh -huh. So I was like, what's your favorite restaurant? I'm like, I haven't been out. And like, you know, you don't get to go out. And you have all this respect for these chefs and, and what they do. And you never really get to really rub elbows. Uh -huh. This kind of forces you to like, I can't be in the kitchen today. Yeah. I have to be in this event. Yeah. And, and especially for Meals on Wheels, it's like such a great reason to get out there and not only see the chefs, but to, you know, talk to your guests and, and to talk about the food and really do what excites us. Yeah, so so it's this, really... a portion of the proceeds for all this do, do go to Meals on Wheels. Correct. And, and, and you guys have been such a big supporter. Why is it so important to make mm. to put that into the public. You know, I think it's important that a lot of times we look at dining in restaurants as this, as this we kind of expect it, yeah, right? And I think yeah. with you, know, especially post-COVID, we realized how special it was. Yeah. And then you realize that there's a population of people that eating can be a luxury, or you know, there yeah. are people who experience so, food insecurity. Mm -hmm. And to be able to kind of take what we do as a, a kind of elevated craft and help it, you know, benefit other people who are just simply trying to eat, I yeah. think really means a lot, especially for for you know the disabled and the homebound. Yeah, yeah. we have an incredible uh, culinary community in Chicago, sure and they're do. always giving back. I don't know how they find the time when they're working all the time. But what are you going to be making? I know it's a surprise. Like it's a secret, like what's going to be served. Right. But is this maybe something that a loo like? This Which absolutely is. is. Okay. Yes. <laughs> so we're actually representing two restaurants, uh, okay. both SKY and Napolonia, mm -hmm. um, and they're actually split, which actually is fun. So okay. we're not going to consolidate into one pod. Uh, we're across from each other, but there's two different experiences altogether. Our third restaurant, Valhalla, is brand new, so hopefully we can uh, we can get in there next year and have three. Um, but for the Apollonia uh, part of the menu, one of the dishes is actually this pan roasted cod Ooh. that we're serving with a pepper rod here that Ooh. has some capers and roasted bell pepper. And this is really reflective, I think, of the way that we cook at Apollonia in terms of that kind of coastal Mediterranean seafood mm. effect. Uh, and I think it's important for the restaurants to represent correctly. Mm -hmm. You know, we want to do like, oh, we're doing sliders and we don't yeah, really do those. Yeah. We really want to give people a taste of how the restaurants operate. Um, so this is, you know, one of our fish courses that we're really, really excited about. Ooh, that looks good. And is this what just is that? like regular this is the, cod? This is a right wine butter sauce. It is a regular cod, but I as you that. know, one of the things that we do is we kind of we kind of roll it in plastic wrap and then poach it really lightly okay. so it has this really beautiful shape and looks like a larger scallop. Yeah. Uh, and yeah. then I think things like this are also really exciting because you're asking questions about the food. Yeah. And as we cook this meal during the event, people can do the same exact thing. And people who come to these events are typically, you know, foodies like yeah. you. And they're really excited and we have an opportunity Amy to too. show them some. Yeah, and Amy's, I'm sure, yeah. right? Yeah. I'm, yeah. The, the, yeah. And then uh, um, it really gives people an opportunity to ask chefs questions like this. Yeah. Which is fun totally. for us too because yes. we want to share a lot of that information. Right. I, do you come away from this too with some new ideas just from working with other chefs? Absolutely. So to your point, we uh, we created a couple of dishes specific for this event. Yeah. And when I was working with the chefs, this is, you know, Fred Taylor, he's a chef of cuisine at uh, oh. SKY, and Joe is our chef de cuisine at Apollonia. I was like, let's come up with these dishes, let's make them really fun, uh -huh. we'll make them reflective of the restaurants. And it turns out the dishes are so good, they're actually going to go on to the menus. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> so it's really nice to kind of have that natural progression of let's do something for this, and then ultimately it's something that people can get if they can't make it to the event. You can still really get a taste of what we operated with and, and working with. You are amazing. How does he cook and also talk at the same yeah. time? So eloquent. <laughs> 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 Unbelievable. Um, no, I know that some chefs don't like the term fine dining, but your two of your restaurants, Apollonia and SKY, are finer dining. Yes. And this new restaurant that you're opening, I just want to give it a quick shout out. It's sure. at Time Out Market. It is. It's a bit of a unique concept in that it's in a food hall. Okay. But it's a chef's counter with a 14 course tasting menu. Oh, oh wow. So we're really kind of graduating the notion of 
fine dining. And you know, a lot of chefs are like, oh, I want it to be fun. Uh -huh. And this one is actually forces you to be because the okay. energy is super palatable yeah. from the downstairs area. Yeah. You come as you are, and it's a really nice way to kind of have caviar Great. and wear shorts and so on and so forth. Okay, caviar and wear shorts. Oh, I like that. <laughs> okay, <laughs> Chef Steven, thank you so much yeah, for joining you. us. There's all the information. I guess there's still tickets available, yeah. I'm hoping. Um, it sounds like a unique event. It's probably yeah. a lot of fun. Really and there's awesome. cocktails, too. So, oh, yes. You know. Well, you know, we both are drinkers, <laughs> too. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs>